Well, we're here in North Topeka where this morning a police officer who was looking for one stolen vehicle actually found another. This all occurred right around the 9.30 hour this morning here in North Topeka, right around Northeast Paramore and Quincy Streets here. Officer Aaron Bulmer of the police department tells me that he was over here in North Topeka taking uh, 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 or searching for a, a vehicle that had been reported stolen in North Topeka earlier today. As he was over here, maybe you can see to my north, straight ahead here, Chris, uh, the um, Garfield Community Center parking lot. He was over here. He saw a vehicle that matched the description of one that had just gone out on the broadcast about two minutes prior uh, of this blue GMC Sierra that had been reported stolen over here from the Little Rush area of North Topeka, just to the east here where we're standing. Now, you all know Little Rush as the home of Perusky's Deli, right? So, uh, burglary had been reported, residential burglary. The, out of that burglary, this blue GMC Sierra had been reported stolen. Now, Officer Bowman tells me he was over here in North Topeka again looking for a different vehicle when he sees this vehicle right over here. It just come out of the scanner uh, on the police radio, I should say, about two minutes before. Two minutes before there had been a broadcast that this blue vehicle was missing and had been stolen. So Officer Bowman again pursues the vehicle down the street here just a short distance. The, uh, the driver of the vehicle then right here at the corner of Paramore and uh, Quincy here got out of the vehicle and took off running. Officer Boomer then got a workout on Labor Day when he chased the driver of this vehicle up through some houses right up here on the 1400 block of Northeast Quincy. The person he said was trying to ditch him, the driver of that vehicle, described only right now as a young, young white female. We don't have any other descriptors at this point. So Officer Bomber did catch up with the individual, and then, as you see, other backup has arrived. Other officers have come to the scene. And so that's the story at this point. This person will, in all likelihood, be headed to jail at some point for at least, at the very least, uh, eluding uh, an officer. But we'll have to go from there as far as the stolen vehicle goes. We don't know that the investigation here is just ongoing at this point. So some excitement in North Topeka on otherwise very quiet Labor Day, other than the rain to the west of us in the Manhattan area. And so we will depart from now again to recap what's happened. If you just joined us, Officer Aaron Bowmore is over here in North Topeka looking for a stolen vehicle. He hears the report over the radio that there's a blue truck that's just been reported stolen from over here in Little Russia. Officer Bowmore then driving through the parking lot over here at the Garfield Community Center. He sees a vehicle matching that description. He follows that vehicle right over here to this stop sign at Northeast Paramore and Quincy, where the driver again stops the truck and takes off running. And again, that chase lasted just a few houses here in the 1400 block of Northeast Quincy. Again, the driver who was in that truck, described again only as a young white female, was running in between these houses here trying to elude the police. But the police did catch up with her and she is now in the police car that you're looking at right there with the lights on. The black and white unit. So a little excitement getting over here in North Topeka on Labor Day. And with that we'll conclude our report. This is Phil Anderson reporting from North Topeka for CJOnline.com and for our Facebook page. Thanks for joining us. Hope you have a great Labor Day.